Today's topic of discussion is a problem which was asked in earlier examination and this problem is related to the chapter direct and bending stresses. A rectangular column has size 0 0.6 meter into 0 0.4 meter. A load of 120 kN acts at an eccentricity of 0 0.14 meter on the axis bisecting the shorter side. Determine resultant stresses developed at base. Draw stress distribution diagram also. So here it is given that the width is 0.6 meter and the thickness will be 0.4 because it is the shorter side. That's why we have taken thickness as 0.4 meter and it is given that eccentricity of 0.14 is on the axis bisecting the shorter side. So xx is bisecting the shorter side which is d is equal to 0.4 meter and the eccentricity is with respect to the y axis. So now B is equal to 0.6 meter, D is equal to 0.4 meter, P is equal to 120 kN, E that is eccentricity 0.14 meter. So we need to find the resultant stresses that is the maximum and minimum intensity of stresses in the section. First we will find the area, area is equal to B into D that is 0.6 into 0.4 we get 0.24 meter square and we need to find direct stress and bending stress so that we can calculate the resultant stresses. So direct stresses sigma naught is equal to P upon A where we know P is equal to 120 kN and A is 0.24 which we calculated over here. So we got direct stress as 500 kN meter square and bending stress that is sigma B is equal to M upon ZYY as we are uh, it is given that eccentricity is with respect to the yy that's why we need to find zyy so m upon zyy and we know m that is moment is equal to p into e that is the force into eccentricity upon zyy is equal to db square upon 6 so the 6 came in the numerator so p into e into 6 upon db square so we put all the values and we got 700 kilonewton per meter square and now we need to find the resultant stresses or maximum and minimum intensity of the stress in the section so sigma maximum on face ab so since it is acting here so what will be the stress on ab and what will be the stress on cd so sigma maximum on face AB, sigma naught plus sigma B, so 500 plus 700, we got sigma maximum as 1200 kN per meter square. So this is compressive on face AB. So here it will be compressive and let us see on face CD. So sigma minimum on face CD is equal to sigma naught minus sigma B, that is direct stress minus bending stress so 500 minus 700 we got sigma minimum is equal to minus 200 kilonewton per meter square so we have tensile on face cd so we have compression here and tensile on face cd now we will draw the stress distribution diagram so this is the cross section and we have been given that on ab it is compressive and the value is given sigma maximum is 1200 kN per meter square and it is given that sigma minimum is tensile which is 200 kN per meter square no need to put sign as we have shown in it already in the diagram so here we will only write the magnitude so this is the stress distribution diagram so this was a problem which was asked in earlier examination please like comment share and subscribe thanks for watching